because today I am going to be sharing a quick look and little kind of first impression review of the Sephora 500 point perk that a lot of us got our hands on and a lot of us wanted to get our hands on um, with Too Faced. It's Bite Size Beauties and it comes with three eyeshadows from the Chocolate Bar Palette, the Chocolate Soleil Bronzer, a deluxe size sample of a melted lipstick, which is in, I think it's Chocolate Honey, I'll tell you in a second, um, Better Than Sex Mascara, and the Too Faced Shadow Insurance. Um, I also have one to give away. I was able to snag two of them because I am a point hoarder. Thumbs up this video if you hoard your points too, because I do it at both Sephora and Ulta. But Anyways, that's besides the point. If you are new to my channel, hi, I am Leah, and it would mean a lot to me if you would subscribe. Um, it's really easy to do. You can just click that subscribe button, or you can just scroll down if you're on your phone, click subscribe. It really does mean a lot to me. I love to share tutorials, hauls. Um, I love just a mix of things. I do workout videos, I do Disney videos, all sorts of stuff, and it really does mean a lot to me to have you subscribe. Every time I get a new subscriber, I really am excited. And if you want to see the videos right away, um, as soon as they go up, go ahead and click on the bell. Once you subscribe to a channel now on YouTube, there's a notification bell. So if you want to see the videos right away, go ahead and click that. That helps me out as well. Okay, so jumping right into this, I was really excited about this. I knew that this was coming out, and I knew I wanted to get my hands on it. Thankfully, um, my friend Jamie, who is also big into makeup, she also wanted this. So as soon as it was up, she told me, and I was able to get one, but it wouldn't let me add two to my cart even though I had all those points. So I uh, bought a little lip mask, just like a super cheap, it's like $3. And so I was able to do that. And I do have the flash shipping since I'm VIB Rouge. So anyway, I ended up with this one and then I have, hang on, another one. So I have two. So this one I've used, this one is for you guys. So one of you will be winning it and there will be a link in the description box for that. And it is a super fair way to do it. That way I'm not picking the winner. It is picking the winner and it will have all the details for that down below. So be sure to check that out if you want to win one of these. Okay, so I was really excited when I got this. I had seen, of course, pictures on Instagram and things, but of course the packaging is super cute. I love all of Too Faced packaging. And it comes with this little cardboard thing that kind of shows you what's gonna be in the box. Then you slide it off and it says $65 value. So that's super cool for 500 points. Um, and then it has the Sephora pretty box and it says um, Beauty Insider. So you open up the box and it has a cute little note from Sephora. Some of this, you know, fluffy paper stuff. And then inside there is a deluxe size sample of the Shadow Insurance. A deluxe size sample of the Better Than Sex Mascara. A deluxe size sample of, oh yeah, I did get the name right, Chocolate Honey, which I do have on my lips today. And then the star of the show, it is so adorable and cute. Look at it against, you know, my palm. It is the Too Faced Chocolate Bar, and it has magnetic packaging, really nice um, packaging. It's not tin like the actual Chocolate Bar palettes. It's a kind of cardboard, but it does look the same. And you open it up, there's no mirror inside, but it says Too Faced, which is cute. Um, and of course, it has that chocolate smell, which is great. Um, but the Chocolate Soleil Bronzer, the Champagne Truffle, Salted Caramel, and Semi-Sweet Eyeshadows. So one thing I thought immediately when I knew that I was gonna get this is, yeah, I definitely have all these colors, but how cute would this be for just traveling and things like that? Because I already have the Chocolate Bar, I already have Chocolate Soleil Bronzer, so I want to swatch the eyeshadows against the Chocolate Bar one just to see, um, you know, are they actually the same? Because sometimes if you get limited edition things or like samples, even if it's the same color, like the same color, it doesn't swatch the same. So I'm really curious to see if it does. And then I did film this eye look, so I'm gonna share that with you as well. All right, there is my blank canvas arm for you. We're gonna go ahead and swatch. First, I'll swatch the color from the deluxe sample from Sephora with the, the Point Perk sample, and then I will swatch with my own chocolate bar palette. So, all right, first, first, we have Champagne Truffle. These, come on, I like so much, <laughs> just drop that. I like so much better when they have it printed on here. Why cannot, like I do not like how on these palettes, you have to use the little plastic thing. But that's why I say that, you know. Oh well, all right, so champagne truffle, there it is, okay. 
So the first thing we're going to do is check out, okay, here is Champagne Truffle swatched from the Sephora 500 point perk. Very pretty. Okay, and now let's do it from the actual chocolate bar and see if they're the same. Okay, yeah, they do look the same to me. They swatch the same, they feel the same. So that to me is the same shadow, very cool. All right, next up we have Salted Caramel. So let's go ahead. Here is the one from the Sephora 500 Point Perk with Too Faced. Okay, there it is. I do not have any primer on my arm or anything, guys. This is just my bare arm, so keep that in mind as well. Salted Caramel, where are you? Oh, there it is. Whoops. All right, here's the one from the Chocolate Bar Palette. Yeah, again, I think that is definitely the same shadow, so super, super nice. That's great, awesome. All right, now we are gonna go into the semi-sweet and then we have semi-sweet on the actual palette. So let's do the 500 point perk first. I'm gonna go to this side of my arm, guys. I ran out of room. Okay, semi-sweet. Swatched really nicely. And then, make sure I do it right. Semi-sweet. Yep. Those are definitely, yeah, they're perfect. They are all the exact same. So that is super cool. I think that's a good thing to check for these palettes because I know I've had some holiday palettes and I'm not just talking Too Faced, I'm talking, you know, all different brands where sometimes they're, you know, great. The limited edition palettes swatch beautifully. The colors are all great. And then other times you're like, yeah, okay, that is not, you know, chocolate soleil bronzer that's the same, you know, you can just kind of tell. So I think it's really interesting to compare it like this. Okay, getting into the look, I do have on this Chocolate Honey Melted Lipstick. Um, I really like it. It's not a color I would have necessarily picked, but I actually really enjoy it, so I'm excited about that. I do want to say that I do have a lip liner on. I have Bobbi Brown's lip liner in Nude on, and then I also, before I put on the lip liner, I did apply a little bit of the too Faced Glossy um, Lip Primer. So I will have those linked down below for you guys as well, but just so you know, it is this color along with those other two items. Okay, to start out the eye look, I did apply some of the Too Faced Shadow Insurance. I love these Deluxe Eye Samples. They last a super long time, so much so that I usually don't actually ever buy the full size. I don't know if I ever have because I always have these samples from different kits. Okay, and then for the eye look, I started out with Champagne Truffle. And I used a Sigma large shader brush, and this is E60, and I put that all over the lid. This would actually be a really, really pretty highlight as well, um, but because I wanted to create a look using only these shadows so you guys could see how to do that, I did just apply this entirely over the lid as a base color after that primer. The next thing I did is I went into the Salted Caramel color, which is such a beautiful crease color. I love those brownie or sometimes kind of more orangey browns. This one is just a beautiful, beautiful kind of clay color. I don't know. It's really pretty. Um, and I use a Luxie brush. This is the 205 Tapered Blending Brush. And I use Windshield Wiper Motions. And I actually kind of I twirl the brush like this as I shade. So it's going like that back and forth. And I do focus more color on the outside of the eye. And then I'm blending in. This is a great brush, but any fluffy blending brush like this will work great for the crease. Then I went into that semi-sweet color or semi-sweet color. I used a Sigma medium angled shading brush. This is the E70, but any angled brush works great. And I really, you could kind of see hopefully that I pretty much stamp on that triangle pattern to give, um, I wouldn't call it quite a cat eye, but like a really subtle cat eye, you know, nothing major, but I stamp it on and then I get that color kind of in that outer corner of the eye, the outer V, and then that is looks a little crazy until you blend it so don't be scared like if it looks kind of like dark and harsh you'll, you'll blend it so it's okay okay then i grabbed a blending brush which this blending brush is the sigma uh, e25 blending brush it is amazing um you can tell this brush gets a lot of love it's got some paint chipped off here and yeah um i do have a couple others of this brush but they're both travel size so i like this one um but i should probably get a new one eventually but anyways i'm telling you guys if you um are new to makeup even if you're not new to makeup this is a great brush it is a staple for me it 
it just blends like a dream. It's a great brush. So you will blend out any of those harsh lines you had and you just blend it away and it is beautiful. Such a great brush. Okay, then I went in, and I know I went out of frame a few times here, so sorry if this part's a little choppy, but I went in with um, a black liquid liner. The one I used is the L'Oreal Liner Intense in black. I love this eyeliner. It is a great, great eyeliner that you can get at the drugstore, but whatever your favorite eyeliner is is totally fine. Um, I also love the Kat Von D eyeliners, like there's tons of them, but whatever your favorite liquid liner is. And I just did a very thin line, no wing, no cat eye today. And then I went in, usually I layer my mascaras, I always usually layer them, but today I wanted to just show what only using the Too Faced Better Than Sex sample that you get with this looks like. So my lashes were not curled and I didn't layer any mascara. So this is with the Better Than Sex. I love the sample sizes of this, it is amazing. Um, it's one of my favorite mascaras and it's great for layering. Usually this is layer two for me though, because I usually start with CoverGirl Clump Crusher. All right, you guys, that is it for this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. That really lets me know what kind of videos you wanna see from me. You can also leave me comments down below letting me know if you snagged this. Um, I will have all the giveaway information again in that link. It's super, super easy to do. Um, I really just, Thought, you know what a nice way I haven't done a giveaway in a really long time what a nice way to give something back to you guys that I know is not only like you had to have the points to get it but it's a great starter set like this would be an awesome gift for someone I'm excited about it even though I technically already have had every single one of these things except for I did not have um, this color of the melted lipsticks it's just super nice for travel it's really really cute um, and then I also, um, I'll see if I have other ones too. I'm going to throw in this sample. Um, I'm going to keep some of them. And then I also like to give my mom um, my samples that I think she would like just because, you know, for years I took basically any free gifts of makeup she ever got. And she always let me. Um, so yeah, I am going to give my mom a lot of them. But uh, these are some YSL lipstick samples that I know she won't like those colors. So I'll toss in that. I'll see if I have any other samples or fun little things too. But if you want to win this, um, definitely just check out the link in the description box and you can enter to win. I will have multiple entry opportunities on that link as well. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope that you have a great day. Don't forget to subscribe and give me a thumbs up. Talk to you guys later. Bye.